Hello and welcome back to Let's Play Crusader Kings 2 The Elder Kings mod, where we are playing as Emperor Theodore Cassander the Wise of the Empire of Cyrodiil. Now, I'm not entirely sure what this will mean, but I do know that right now, as of right now, Theodore has now mastered two skills in the magic uh, skill specialization. Now, what I believe that means... I believe that means he is able to uh, level up from a Master Mage to a Legendary Mage. I'll have to see, uh, because a Legendary Mage gains access to certain types of spells that are not available to anybody else. Uh, most notably the ability to make oneself immortal, but also... I know in previous patches, I don't know in the, uh, uh, versions of Elder Kings, I'm not sure if in this one, the, the ability to summon much larger Daedric armies than you can um, with your uh, default summoning. So let's see if, if this does it. He is not, He's still at the uh, Master level. At least right now he is. You're only permitted two specializations. Is the thing so the maybe the ability to reach that is just he just doesn't have it he just can't do it now hmm No, again, I have the money to usurp a title. I don't want to do that at present. Potentate Alessia. Interesting that the uh, Count Jensen, my son-in-law, useful to get member, get friends onto the council. Anyway, um, another thing that has occurred is that uh, the defensive pact against me has, in many in many spots, been weakened. Um, I would like it if um, if I could conquer at least the rift. I can't go to war with Horan because I've al I've already been to uh, I, I I have a truce with them, and. Um, yeah, getting the truce breaker trait is not good. It uh, it loses you a whole bunch of prestige. Um, so in the meantime, more uh, more raiders have arrived. I may need to just focus on the northeast of Cyrodiil. Or at the very least, I, I should be saving up to uh, kill this fellow. Okay, now I can finally kill the King of Hammerfell. Being Dark Brotherhood, I will do it myself. Pay the 240 gold for it. Get this job done. He's alone and unaware of my entrance. Alright. Yes, unnoticed. I wonder, does this get her out of the court? No. Yes, they all appear to have reached majority is one problem. This is all taking too long.
But in the meantime... I think we've got time for a uh, good old-fashioned conquest of the Rift. So, let's get our main army, our half Daedric retinue, into place. Because, uh, who knows when the, uh... Next time we'll have, uh, such things available to us will be. I mean, who knows when, uh... Who knows if, if and when, uh, the, uh... Our, uh, Emperor is going to die. So, yeah, the Rift, that's quite a sizable chunk of Skyrim. It would get us uh, well on our way toward uh, establishing another kingdom for our empire. Specifically, the kingdom of Skyrim, which has always been such an important, has always been so closely linked. All right, uh, the Alderman of Horan. Can't yet, uh, usurp that title. Yep. Ogain, okay, ah, the guy who was trying to raid me. Can't ransom him. He's an enemy. Let's execute him. Gored to death by a boar. That's, you know, always like the creative ones. Uh, my grandson is now Count Theodore the Able. Which seems appropriate. He seems quite talented. Shit! So, yeah, the Earl of Horun has joined him. That's not ideal. But I think we still will win. Quite handily. Ah, and meanwhile... More proficient commander. I'm already at veteran, so does that... Elite. I think I have to become legendary first, so... has declared Pell's conquest of Sajanus. So... What is your war goal, then? I suspect it must be, uh...
Actually, I think we might, despite being outnumbered, win that battle. Yeah, so we did. Ah, okay. Well, my steward has disappeared because my steward is now the Empress. Specifically, Empress Alessia II. Is this war over? I hope not. Or... Oh, wait, no! Alessia's dead! Fuck! That sucks! How did she... What did she die of? Oh, she died in battle. No! She was a legendary mage. She was a great heir. Oh, I'm heartbroken. I would rather it have been Theodore. Honestly. I could have lived with that. Well, we'll have Theodore the Younger, I guess. Oh, that's terrible. I mean, there go my fucking plans. Well, he's all right. He's no Alessia. I'll tell you that much. Well, that's Crusader Kings 2 for you. It's, uh, you know, frustrating, unexpected stuff like that happens all the time. I was, you know, it's a silly small thing, but I was kind of looking forward to the fact that, you know, after all those many thousands of years, she would be Alessia the second. You know, the second one. Like, going back all the way to the very, very first. But, it's just a dream now. Let's go with the most competent person possible, and, um, see how pissed Carmalo is at us. Ugh, not that pissed. So we can manage. So who's our wizard, or our regent? Suppose it is going to have to be our grandson. who is a disappointment compared to uh, her, his aunt, but still a direct grandson of mine. I raised him personally. That's where my, thr that's where my uh, thirst for blood got me. It, it, it's, a, it, it's a classic tragedy.
But never mind, let's finish prosecuting this war. We, we it's not like we it's not like we've totally lost all hope. I mean, lest we forget, our our air is our air is still really damn good. Let's take a look and see how the succession is going. That's how it's going. All right. Yeah, we, we still have it secured to our second choice of heir. You know, it's somebody younger. I'll say that. That's always good. Who's head of the Elder Council now? Uh, it's still the, yeah it's it's still the heir is that always is that always the case or is is it just a coincidence that it's been my heir two times in a row all right young Euraxia, my prisoner this pleases me so let us release her Speaking of prisoners, how's, uh, how's my kidnapping attempt going? Should get to making as many assassinations as possible before my character kicks the bucket, because he's getting up there in years. Now, who, sh who then shall be the Paramount Knight? I think Count Jensen, the, uh, the Brave, that's a good choice. In the meantime, I think this should be a successful attack. Potentate Theodore, the young the young prince, has proposed to induct Countess Perennia of Facian into the Elder Council. Sure, she likes me well enough, and probably likes him well enough. Okay. We lost a lot of dudes in that battle because they were committed piecemeal and kind of haphazardly. Now, Carmelo, sure. Family members on the council is was 2-4 to 40 opposed, huh? Wonder what they don't like about him. Fine. All right, our tax collector is in the Imperial Isle. Sent me the labor. Famous writer proposes to compose my family chronicles. I 
I think that's something that he would do. Meantime, see if we can't kill ourselves another king. Shit, I'm in jail now. I wonder if there are any spells that can help me with this. Yeah, I shouldn't have gotten greedy there. died in the dungeons, and so I believe that's uh, this war over. Kind of an anticlimactic way for our Emperor's rule to end. But so it must go. And I think uh, that's going to have to be a good place to leave it. Uh, we have uh, lost entirely too many of our uh, of our most uh, of our most beloved uh, of of our most skill of our, both the, our emperor itself and his beloved daughter and heir. But Emperor Theodore the Second the Able shall continue to rule in the name of the Cassanders. We will have to see how successful he can be. He's a good mage and a good uh, commander, but not that not particularly great at anything else. So we're going to have to see how successful we can be with him. We've lost a whole bunch of CBs because uh, I don't think you can war uh, you can warlord if you're only emperor of Cyrodiil and not of Tam Tamriel. So um yeah, that's going to be a challenge. But it's a challenge that's going to have to wait until next video. Until next video, I have been Marikati, you have been you. Remember to like, share, and subscribe, and I will see you next time.